in sort of eureka moment. <coughs> and that's where you know you come come up with the idea. You figure out the best way to like uh, answer this question that you have. And then the sixth part is the most difficult part, I think. That's where you have to make the thing, you know? You've, you've come up with the idea, and then at some point you have to, uh, you have to just sit down and move forward with the information that you have and make the thing. And then the seventh part is, uh, is criticism. So, in science, it's called testing. In art, we call it criticism. It's just sharing your ideas with your peers, you know? Um, like putting your work out there into a forum. You know, seeing if you were successful in your uh, question and in your research. Um, and, so those are the seven steps of of creativity. Does anyone, at this point, does anyone like uh, have anything that they want to talk about? About those? Any questions? What did you say this process was based off of? Like, um, what did it also apply to? Philosophical midwifery, which is just uh, like philosophy, basically. Like, uh, you know, you come up with you come up with a question, you do your research, you know, um, just thinking about stuff, that's, um, so, any other questions? Yeah? Um, well, is there a question, but, um, like, I guess, like, a comment, mm -hmm. uh, for, like, step four, yeah. I, there's actually, like, a really, like, important step that I never, like, thought about, because it's true, like, you do have to, like, stop researching and then do something else to, like, get your mind off of it. Because mm -hmm. um, that was like, you know, something that I do a lot, just like think and think and think and like, like never actually like, stop the research or like take a moment to step back. But, um, but yeah, I think that was like, that's like an interesting point to like bring up, you know, that you should just like go and like clean dishes or something. Yeah, like, well, I mean, it's, it's important to wash your dishes. Yeah. <laughs> nobody, nobody wants bugs, you know. Um, but, uh, I mean, do you guys see yourselves sort of going through these steps, uh, like, without realizing what they are? No? Yeah? Maybe. Um, so they don't really need to happen in any order, um, I think. Like, sometimes you can have a eureka moment that then leads you to researching. Um, and then, or sometimes you can be making something and, um, like, without having, and that, Sometimes the making can be the research. They're all sort of interchangeable, and they're more like a cyclical process, where one leads to the other. You know, and that's that's the best way um, for it to go. Um,